we got a brand new update for you guys. Zebra Sonic is in the game, but don't worry, guys. There's some new features that you guys are going to really like for this update. I'll explain the new features. We'll do everything here. So before we get into the video, I need you guys to subscribe to my channel right now with all notifications. I'll give you a second to do that. Only if you're a Sonic fan. Did you do it yet? Okay, and hopefully you guys hit that like as well. By the way, chat, me and my brother have a joint channel called The Blocks Bros. We are picking winners in every single video. If and only if you actually like Roblox, if you're a Roblox fan, go to our latest video where we fight the rogue AI, drop a like in the video, watch it unfold, comment your Roblox name to be picked as a winner for Robux. We pick out probably two maybe three winners a video we'll do it every single video go subscribe to the blocks bros if you like roblox like i said remember if you want to win watch a new video comment your name like it all that with that being said let's get in to the zebra sonic update here we go chat oh my god i'm so riders vector oh my goodness whatever we'll, 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 we'll talk about this later so zebra sonic here he is what are our quests to get him this is a podium event so the first thing we're going to have to do is we're going to have to collect 1,000 Chaos Orbs. Now, that's kind of a lot. Honestly, what I like to do for this is... It looks like we already have the quest picked up, if I'm not mistaken. Do I have the quest picked up? Hold on one sec. Let me see if I got them. Okay, it's working. It's working. All right, so you guys know the drill. First things first. Actually, as a matter of fact, boost time, races, grind real points, and destroy bad nicks. The first thing you should do... If you're trying to do a fast, auto queue for a race. In between your races... Wait, get, let me get off the... Yo, 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 yo. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Chat, 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 chat. Let me get off the... Yo, you guys, yo, you guys already know. You guys see the boy right here. Classic Sonic, baby. You guys see him right here. We got our boy Classic Sonic. Uh, you're going to do a couple of laps around Green Hill. Of course, boom, boom, boom. Hit those bad nicks along the way. I believe your event shell will actually carry over for this in order to do this, but... I wouldn't say Green Hill is the best place to do this, per se. Let me see if the, uh, let's see if the, let, let's check our quest real quick. Where's our quest? Where's our quest? Oh, the Zebra Sonic event. Uh, boost time counts and grind rail. Okay, cool. So you can kind of do this in between races. This is actually going to be one of the easier events, which is okay. I mean, listen, I'm here for it. Easy skin to get. If it's easy, then that's fine. I know a lot of you guys have been having trouble with some of these events sometimes here and there. So what I would do if I were you in between races, we should be queued up for at least five races. You're going to be doing loops around Green Hill. The reason why I wouldn't really bother going to other places is very simple. It's because once you complete a race, you spawn back in Green Hill. Now you can along the way, you could tag up some of these bad necks. Ready? Bop, bop, bop. You could tag them up along the way. You have to get 500. So that's going to be a little bit of a challenge for some of you guys, I would imagine. Obviously, you only get a couple uh, per time. So what you should do in between these races, just simply run around Green Hill, boost as much as you can, collect as many Chaos Orbs as you can. Because you have to do races, you should be queuing for them in between. Because you'll be getting Chaos Orbs in the races. You'll be killing Bad Nicks. You'll be grinding. You'll be doing... A lot of this can be done in, in just a couple of races. So this is actually pretty easy why don't we go do a race real quick and take out some of our viewers because we don't lose bro csdg classic sonic you see the boy right here we don't lose bro all right first race is metal city now if you want to complete this race as fast as possible it's pretty simple you're gonna want to um all right don't do what i'm doing right now you're gonna want to take advantage of the trick system basically every time you jump it's gonna replenish your uh it's gonna replenish your boost energy so this is gonna help you beat this one as fast as possible you should be queuing up for metal city realistically if you want to beat this one as quickly as possible so let's do that let's do that and boom look at that i would say this is the this is the one though if you want to do these races fast metal city is the one without any glitches or skips or tricks or anything like that this is going to be the fastest way to do it all right oh my god it looks like we have another race queued up bro another race has been queued. okay there we go another race has been queued up someone wants to beat me honestly guys if you get city escape you're gonna get a lot of boost time uh, this is the best race probably for boosting time. I'm not going to lie. You get a lot, a lot, a lot of boosting time. Boosting time is going to actually be the one that takes you probably the longest for this. You'll get a lot of chaos orbs in this one and a lot of boosting time. So let's just run it up real quick. I want to beat these guys too. It's a good thing that this, uh, this event kind of uh, taps into everything that the game has to offer. We're going to be racing. We'll be boosting. We'll be collecting stuff. 
This is a this is a pretty cool challenge. We'll be grind, we'll be on the grind rails and stuff like that. It's really it's really a multifaceted update. The good thing is is that this skin is easy to unlock, and there's also another really easy skin to unlock. We'll talk about Rider's Cream in a second because that is also another skin that has been leaked out. Okay, here we go. Oh, 25,000 grind rail. Is that what we need? Okay, that's a little bit that's a little bit more difficult. Look at that. Boom. That's how you're gonna be city escape race as fast as possible. Let's keep grinding though, chat. I also forgot to show you guys what exactly is for sale this week. Tornado's on sale for 50% off. We have these random Sonic skins on sale. Summer Sonic skins are on sale. Riders Amy, Riders Rouge, Classic Tales, Fake Metal Sonic, Fake Metal Knuckles, the Blue Star Golden is on sale. And a bunch of uh, other hoverboards are on sale as well. Is there anything else in here? Anything else that's cool? Blue Android Shadow is still in the spin wheel. So if you guys haven't unlocked this guy yet, he is still here. He's still here, guys. Do not worry. He's still in the game. So guys, we're gonna we're gonna keep grinding. We're gonna show you guys everything you need to do for grind reels. I would say, I mean, this isn't really that difficult. You can literally for the grind rail section of this quest, just go right over here. Look at that. Look at that. So easy to get grind rail points. And let's go down. I don't even know how you. I think boosting maybe helps you for this. Look at that. Ready? Boom. Look at that. Ready? Let's go all the way around. It's like a ride. It's like we're on a ride right here. This is gonna be the fastest way to get the grind rail points. I would say you could do them in like a metal madness race or something like that. But I mean, listen, do what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Uh oh, we got a big race right here. We got a big, big race right here. What do we got? All right, let's show you guys the fastest way on how to do Emerald Coast. This is this is what you're gonna to want to do. You see all these guys over there? That's not what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to go this way. We're gonna take a little shortcut. I actually zoomed in a little bit. I did not mean to do that. Oh, all right, you're not supposed to do that either. Oh, oh okay, all right. Look at that. Okay, all right. That's, that wasn't supposed to happen, but that's okay. So, for Emerald Coast, normally you're going to hit a spin dash launch right off of that thing right there. And for this part, just boost. Tap the boost. If you tap boost, it's going to help you complete these races faster. Not that there's many to do, but tapping boost is definitely faster. Although, in races, there's a lot of rings, so you might actually grind out a lot of boosting time by doing that. So, keep that in mind. Look at that. Spin dash launch off of that, and that's going to give you a nice little boost right there. Also, right here... Look at that. Hold the spin dash. You see how much faster I just went right there? Oh, God. No. 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 Dude. Oh, God. Yeah, you're going to want to take this route right here. Take the inside route. Oh, my God. I'm getting smoked right now. You're going to want to, you're going to, want to avoid that grind rail right there. Drop dash off this. Spin dash off the ledge. And just like that, you go over to the side right here. That's going to be the fast way to do Emerald Coast. I, I kind of scuffed it, but yeah. Emerald Coast, that's what you got to do for that one. Q for races, boost, and do all that stuff in between. All right, Chad, here's our last race. Here's our last. We've done almost everything. We need boost time, racing, and then bad nick. So once we finish the last race, I'll be able to explain to you guys how to do the bad nick. I mean, the bad nick is pretty easy. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, but here we go, guys. I'm actually trying to grind boosting time right now. I could be rolling. I could be going for the win. I would love to win, obviously. We love winning. We don't like we don't like to lose over here, but you know we gotta do we gotta do what we gotta do sometimes. You know what I mean? Let's here we go. Here we go. How much boost time do we get, bro? We got like none. Does that even count? Am I getting boost time, Bruh. Bro, what? Why are they not counting my boost time? All right, something's up. Something's up, chat. Something is all right. Whatever. We still gotta we gotta hit the race anyway, so it doesn't really matter. You'll get some grind rail points right here too, by the way, which is good. Here we go. Do we have to boost an open world? There we go. Go over here. I don't know. It looks it looks kind of bugged. All right, and boom! Did I win? Did I win? All right, so that's that's the races, guys. All right. Last but not least, let's finish up our boost time requirement. We are in Emerald Hill. Yes, a zone that I don't come to much, but honestly, it's like one of my favorites. I feel like it's a very it feels very open world Sonic-y. I don't know. Green Hill obviously was like based off of the old green hill this one feels like we're literally in a sonic open world i don't know maybe that's just me so zebra sonic guys we've done everything four out of five objectives the last thing you're going to want to do is equip your best chows typically ones that have damage stat on them hop on your tornado and get busy bro get busy in emerald hill this is always in my estimation the fastest way to get bad nicks of course you can get them in the middle of green hill if you don't have Emerald Hill unlocked. But this is by far the definitive, the fastest way to get the Badnik requirement. So we're going to go around here 
and take out all these guys. Right, we got one over here. Boom, 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 boom. Get some over here. It's kind of a little loop. I would say like this bottom area definitely has the most. There's so you know, if you want, you can kind of search around a little bit. Like you go up here, there's some. Oh, there's a big, big amount over here. Go up here. Like there's definitely some down here too. Boom, boom, boom. You might want to hit that. Where do you find the Zebra Sonic quest? It is right and smack in the middle of Green Hill, bro. Right smack in the middle. Yeah, we're all about our tornado right now. I don't have my Chrome tornado because I'm uh, on the test servers. I'm surprised my purchases don't transfer over. Kind of annoying, but let's go. Let's take out these guys up here. We actually took out all the bad nicks, so we kind of have to. We gotta make a. We gotta make our rounds real quick. There's some over. Like they're all over Emerald Hill, realistically. This isn't something that's going to take you that much longer. You're not really going to be going out of your way to do this one is what I'll say. Let's go up here again because there's a decent amount up here. There's a decent spawn area right here. Boom, boom, boom. What do you guys? I mean, I think it's a good update. One, it's easy. Two, I like the skin. Three, it again expands the arsenal of what you're supposed to do in the game. We like when we have to actually like play, you know what I'm saying? It's like a lot of these stuff, a lot of this stuff can be done passively. And I like that you can do it all at once. Now that's new. They also have the daily rewards uh, system, which is something we'll explain in a second on how to unlock Rider's Cream, because that's also really easy too. So uh, QOL is good. There's a new system in the game, new skin, easy to get. You know what I mean? There's nothing really, there's nothing really to be sad about, nothing to complain about. I, I like the skin. Let's just go ahead and let's see how far. All right, 423. We're right there, bro. We are right there. We have like a couple more loops around. Do you think they should improve the animation for Sonic? I think the OG one's fine. Um, I, I'm curious to see how this new Zebra Sonic looks, though. I'm pretty curious to see. This guy says, please give me Robux. Bro, subscribe to Blocks Bros. That's where the Robux is. I'm not really going to be giving out Robux that much in this channel. It's all going to be on the Blocks, bro. <gasps> No, they shut down the experience! Alright, we're back. We're back. Alright, guys. Let's go unlock the skin. Boop, boop, boop. Alright, let's just we're just gonna finish it out in Green Hill. I'm getting three per. I don't know if this is gonna be on the main server, so just keep that in mind. Um, we'll have to let you guys know about that. And boom! We just unlocked the brand new Zebra Sonic. And guys, don't worry, there's one more skin for you guys to unlock. Look at my boy. Oh, he's got the drip, bro. He's drippy. I love, I love, I love the idle animation. It looks really good. He's got a little necklace. My guy's dripped out. Look at him. He does a little... I like that. I like that a lot. I think that that right there is from Shadow the Hedgehog from 2005. I think he does that in the game. He kind of does a little, like... He does a little, little little fight in that game. So, I don't know if that's what that's from. Um, are these animations any different? They look a lot more smooth. I think he's got new animations, though. I think. I don't really know. They look like they're new animations, but I, I I couldn't I couldn't really put it to the test. That drop animation, definitely new. And it looks more it looks very Sonic 06-esque right there. These are some smooth, like bouncy animations. You know what I mean? Like very smooth, very, very good animations. He has some new grind animations too. I really like the skin a lot, actually. He's got some really good running animations. I don't know if the other Sonics have been changed, but. Here's his grind animations. He does a little, little back and forth action. Let's see what we got. Let's go up here with him. Yeah, that's him, chat. He looks good. The new skin looks good, chat. We like it. I'm a fan of the new skin. It looks pretty solid. What do you guys think about it? Do you guys like the new... You guys like his new getup? You guys think he looks drippy? You're going to have to let me know. You're going to have to let me know down below in the comments, bro. Let me know down below in the comments. Chat, don't think I forgot about you guys. There's one last skin in the update. Let's claim our daily rewards. We're going to unlock this in one minute. So, guys, essentially what this system is, every single day that you log in, you will be able to unlock a reward. There is nothing you have to do other than simply log in. So all you have to do, log in the game, claim your reward, log back in the next day, and then you're good. So with that being said, a new system has been added to the game. You can get some chows. You can get some hoverboards. You can get a lot of cool stuff. So again, I think this is good. This is going to increase 
player engagement. It's going to bring people into the game every day. A reason, to, again, another reason, as long as there are reasons for me to log in the game, I'm cool with that. In addition to that, I think it makes it more Roblox simulator E, which I think the game could use a little bit more. I've been playing, for you Roblox heads out there, I've been playing some Roblox games recently because I have the Blox Bros channel. I've been playing games like Arm Wrestle Simulator and stuff like that, and they're like very popular. And not that they're, they're not better than SSS. SSS is a better game than them. But I do think they could add a little bit more Roblox-y, simulator-y type stuff. In addition to that, like with the progression as well. So that's something that certainly helps. I like it. It's It costs nothing. You log in, you get a reward. So it's going to add more people playing the game daily. And other than that, that is the update, guys. Let me know what you guys think about it down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.